Hello, are you stuck on solving this maths problem? Welcome, I will show you on how to work it out within the shortest time possible. So let us start with the solution. So now our solution, this one is the maths problem that you are having. So 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a is equals to 48. So the first thing that you need to do is to work out or factorize 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a. So this one can also be written as 3 to the power of a into bracket 1 plus 1 is equals to 48. So from here now, we shall now have it as 3 to the power of a into bracket 1 plus 1 is 2 is equals to 48. So here now we shall divide both sides by 2, then both sides by 2. So now our result shall be 3 to the power of a is equals to, so now we shall have it as 24. So now, how do we now move or get the value for a? It's simple. Let's now introduce the log. That is the trickiest trick that you never know. So when you introduce the log, we shall now have the log of 3 to the power of a is equals to the log of 24. So assume we have the log of x to the power of y. This one can also be written as y, the log, the log of x. So the log of 3 to the power of a can also be written as a log 3. So a, the log of 3, is equals to the log of 20, of 24. So next step, we shall say that, so next, shall divide both sides by the log of 3, then here also by the log of 3. So log 3 and log 3 shall cancel each other. So now our a shall be the log of 24 all over the log of 3. So now our a, when you factorize this number, so the log of 24 can also be written as the log of 8 multiplied by, multiply by 3, then all over the log, the log of 3. So suppose we have something like the log of x multiplied by y, so this one can also be written as the log of x, then also plus the log of the log of y. So in short now, the a log 8 multiplied by 3, we can still rewrite it as the value for a is equals to the log of 8 plus the log of 3, then all over all this divided by the log of 3. So here now, we shall now proceed by saying that our value for a is equals to, so let's now change the log of 8, can also be written as the log of 8 or so the log of 8 can also be written as the log of so 2 to the power of to the power of 3 then plus plus the log of plus the log of 3 then all over all over the log of 3 on this other side so from here now we can write it as fresh by saying that our value for a is equals to so the log of 2 to the power of 3 can be written as 3 the log of 2 then all over, then all over the log of 3, so all over the log of 3, then plus, so here now we had the log 3, so it shall still be log 3, then divide by the log of 3, down here, the log of 3. So next we shall say that, so here our value for a shall be now is equals to, so here we shall have 3, then the log of 2, then all over the log of 3, there, then plus. So here log 3 and log 3 shall cancel, so here now shall remain with 1. So when you have the log of P all over the log of M, so this one can also be written as the log of P to the base of M. So similarly, here our log of A shall be written as 3, 3, the log of 2 to the base of 3, then plus, plus 1. So this are now qualifies to be our correct, correct answer. So if you really loved how we worked it out, please don't forget to subscribe. So let's now confirm it. So in confirm, so our equation was 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a is equals to 48. So we had factorized all of this by now having as 3 to the power of a is equals to 24. So meaning that our 3 to the power of a should be now be equivalent to to what we had written as the value for a so we had 3 the log of 2 
So 3 to the power of a, which now shall be equivalent to 3, the log of 2 to the base of 3, then plus, plus 1. So, the, so this one now shall be 3 to the power of 3, the log of the log of 2 to the base of 3, then plus, plus 1. So from here now we shall say that 3, uh, when you write it afresh, we shall now have 3. So to the power of 3, the log of 2 to the base of 3, then the plus shall change to multiplication. Then again 3 to this one, to the power of 1, should give us 24. So from here now, we will work it out. So the log to the base of 3 shall cancel this 3. So now we shall now have 2 to the power of 3. So we shall write it by having 2 to the power of 3. Multiply by 3 to the power of 1 is 3 is equals to 20, 24. So 2 to the power of 3 is 8. Then 8 multiplied by 3 is equals to 24. So 8 multiplied by 3 is 24 is equals to 24. So meaning that we are very correct when you concluded that the value for a in this case, so our value for a in this case is equals to 3, the log of 2 to the base of 3, then plus, plus 1. So this qualifies to be our correct answer. So let's stop there and see you in our next video.